How's it going, everybody? Oh, um, lady, thanks for the sub, and Kiara. Let's see. Um, another chill day? Yep, something like that. Um, let's see. There's a game called Among Us you should try. We tried to. It's just hard to get everyone together for it. Um, we were going to have that old Among Us throwback thing, but everyone was busy, so. Oh, uh, Twig. Thanks for the sub, Twig. We playing games today? Yep. That's the plan. Um, playing with a mouse today. Hey, where'd you guys hear that from? Um, let's see. How's EDC? It was pretty fun. It was pretty fun. Schedule? What schedule? Hey. Um. Oh, Tass, thanks for the sub. Let's see. Horror stream. Probably not today. Um, what games are we playing today? Not 100% sure. Um, if I'm honest, a lot of people aren't going to be on GTA today, so we might try that later maybe. I'm thinking we've we got a couple random scuffed games in mind. Um, other than that, we're always, we usually just start off chilling with chat for the most part. You went to EDC? Yep. It was pretty fun, actually. I think I would go again next year. Um, it's kind of fun. AB, thanks for the sub. And impossible. Hope you're feeling better. Uh, well, I'm not feeling very... I wasn't... I'm not too sick or anything. I was a little bit tired, though. Phasmophobia. That could be fun. I heard there's a really... There's a... There's a new update or something, right? Um, Don, thanks for the sub. Um, and Kaya, thanks for the sub also. Are you dressing up for ho I don't know. Um, I don't have an outfit, if that's what you're asking. Did you end up going to Ryan's house? No, he couldn't. We, man, So the, here's what happened, guys. I don't want to say the restaurant, because, oh, you guys probably understand why. But um, we, we reserved a dinner uh, at a, a certain restaurant that I'm not going to name for various reasons. Um, it was like me, Yvonne, Toast, me, you know, me, a bunch of friends. We went to a restaurant, we were one minute late, and they kicked us out. So, it was, it was a little sad, we, we got, uh, we were one minute late, and they kicked us out, so we had to get, find dinner somewhere else, uh, and that delayed us so much that we, we couldn't make it to Ryan's house, unfortunately. We were gonna go right after dinner, uh, but yeah. What? Yeah, it, it sucks. Legit one minute, guys. And they said, "Nope, sorry, you can't, you can't, you can't eat." And we were just like, "Oh, that's that's unfortunate." So, um, that's crazy. I mean, technically we were late, but it was legit one minute late. So it was like I was absolutely shocked. But um, what can you do? Um, Pinecone, thanks for the sub and Gab. Oh, and uh, Fallout, thanks for the sub also. Exactly one minute. Yeah, exactly one minute, guys. Um, it was at, it It was 10 was the last, like, chance or whatever. We showed up, or actually, we showed up early, but since we took different, uh, like, taxis or something, um, half of the squad showed up later, and they were like, we can't seat you unless the entire table's here. So the second, like, three of us were already there, and then the other three showed up legit one minute late. And they said we couldn't we couldn't go. So it was it was it was like we were kind of demoralized after that. And then what happened was um we were just like, well, let's go find some other food. And it took us a while to find somewhere else to eat. And uh and then by then it was like late and we couldn't go to Ryan's. So it was unfortunate. Um Cray, thanks for the sub. And Phoenix, uh Lauren and Axel. That's kind of weird. I mean Technically, we were late, but I just feel like they should have gone easier because half of our group was there already, right? Like, we had three. Uh, three of the people were already there, and, like, we were just like, yeah, the rest of them are going to be here in, like, a minute. And then one minute late, and there it went, guys. There it went. Um, I, I feel like they're just a little too strict, but that's just what I think. Um, Granny, thanks for the five gifted, Granny. It's a whole bunch of gifted. Thanks a bunch. Um... Let's see. Oh, and Silent. Thanks for the sub also. Alright. 
Squid Games this Friday? I heard it's this Friday, I think. Um, something like that. All right. The only problem is it is at 2 a or not 2 a.m. Uh, 2 p.m. So it's a little bit early for me, but um, yeah. Honestly, it sounds like they gave your table away. No, they didn't. They had like a legit half the restaurant was empty. So I'm pretty sure they had space. They, you know, we just were late and I guess they're very, very strict. So yeah. Um, Mimi, thanks for the sub and Faz and Brittany. Anyway, I, I don't want to say the restaurant for various reasons, but yeah, it was just, it was just weird. You know, I don't say this too often, but it was just kind of weird, champ. Um, anyway. Um, did you find something to eat? Yeah, I think we ended up just, like, ordering room service or something, but... Um... Anyway... They lost themselves money. I mean, guys, you know, what can you say? We were technically late, and that's... I still thought it was weird, man. Who does that? Um... Anyway, Oob, thanks for the sub, and Brittany. And, uh, Jack, thanks for the five gifted. Are you sick? Uh... No, I don't, I don't think I'm sick. Uh, I have bigger eye bags because of the lack of sleep, probably, but I don't think, um, I don't, I don't think I'm sick at all. Um, quiet, thanks for the sub, and Majin. All right. Um, uh, what's the plan today? We're just gonna chill the chat for a bit, probably play some random games, and then, um, what's it called? And then I think we're playing, yeah, I don't know what we're playing. We're just playing some random stuff, probably. Anomaly, thanks for the five gifted, Anomaly. You gonna play Left for Dead again? Uh, probably not. I I genuinely think Back for Blood is just better. The only problem with Back for Blood is the difficulty scaling. I feel like Recruit is too easy, and then Veteran is too hard a, a little bit. So, it's weird. I, I feel like I really want to like it. It's just the scaling is, like, not, not very, like... It's either too hard or too easy, and it's just kind of a weird situation. It's a subtle sniffle? What? Um, I, I, I don't know, guys. I don't feel sick at all. I, uh, so, sorry if I'm, if I sound sick. I, I, I genuinely don't know what to say to that. Um, anyway, uh, Quinn, thanks for the sub, and Jazzy. All right. You sound fine? Yeah, I, I don't know, guys. I, it's, it's kind of awkward when someone's like, man, you, you guys ever... Okay, so I'm not, I'm not a girl, so this hasn't happened to me. But I've, I've known people who are like, they don't put on makeup. And everyone's like, are you sick? Are you sick or something? And they're obviously not sick. And then it's just awkward. That, does that happen to people? I, I feel like people have told me it happens. It's never happened to me because obviously, you know, like... But man, I feel like it's the same vibe where it's like... Like, obviously nothing's wrong with you, but people just ask you if something's wrong with you, and you're like, well, now I feel like something's wrong with me. But, um, anyway. Plimbo, thanks for the sub, and pretty. Are you going to LA? Um, I mean, eventually, I'm sure. I don't know exactly what, uh, yeah. I mean, I, I think I'll be going eventually. I'm not sure what that means exactly. Probably not right now. I'm pretty pooped out. Um... Let's see. Uh, Gore, thanks for the sub, Gore. Did you have fun in the helicopter ride? Yeah, but it was super expensive. I, I don't know if I'd say it's worth it again. Um, why is the day scuffed? I don't know. It probably always is, but most part of the fun. Um, Knight, thanks for the sub, Knight. How much was the helicopter? Uh... I don't know if Tony said, but I'm just gonna say it was, um, it was a lot. Um, it was expensive. Quite ex I think it was like four, I shouldn't even say, but it was pretty expensive. Was it worth it? Um, I mean, it was fun. Um, 500 a person, yeah, was, uh, I think it was a bit over 500 a person, and then there's seven of us, and then there's tax. I think it was around four, it was expensive, is all I can say. Um, yeah. Knight, thanks for the sub. Let's see. Still cheaper than in GTA? Yeah, renting a helicopter in GTA is like 5k, but you get, you get it all day. This was one ride, so 
it was it was an experience, I suppose. Um, and it did save a lot of time because, guys, if you take a bus uh, to the event, it takes three hours, uh, which is pretty pretty long. You know, it really. It, it, it was a lot nicer, but man, it's expensive, so I, I don't know. Um, let's see. Uh, Sarah, thanks for the sub. Um, what? Yeah, guys, it takes like three hours. I mean, the event ends at like, I think like five-ish, and we would get back to the hotel at like 8 a.m. It was, it was scuffed. Uh, I probably did not sleep enough. Um, yeah. Fire, thanks for the sub. When is fall, guys? I'm not 100% sure, actually, but we'll see. You having bad weather in Vegas? I don't think so. I kind of like uh, I kind of like the weather. It's It's been, like, raining a little bit. I kind of like the rain. I wouldn't like it if it rained every day, but I think once in a while it's not bad. Did you buy a Rolex with the boys? Uh, no, but I think Blau has one. Tony has one. I think Ray's thinking of getting one. Mr. Lang might be getting one, too. Man, I... I just wish they weren't so expensive. Can I get one for like 500 bucks or something? Like anyone want to sell me one for five? Because like everyone else has one and it's like $15,000 and I'm like, guys, I don't even have a car yet. I could buy a car with that. I guarantee you I'd get more value out of the car first because right now I've driven my parents' old Prius that broke down once already. So I don't know. Well, what, what did he say? I didn't see it. Um, I, it. The chat moves quick sometimes, but... Heard you saying stuff about my shoes? Wait, I didn't say anything bad about his shoes at all. Uh, well, okay, it depends on what you think of bad, because I didn't say my opinion on it. I just said the facts. And the facts are, my shoes got made fun of, but my shoes are like 20 bucks, and they're like 10 years old. Blau's shoes also got made fun of, and I think they were hundreds of dollars, um, and brand and like pretty new, so... Um, you know, I'm just saying, at least I saved money while getting roasted. Uh, he just got roasted regularly and spent a lot of money. But I think his shoes look nice. So that's just my opinion. But um, facts. Guys, it, it was so awkward. Like, no no memes. We were sitting in the elevator, right? And they're talking about shoes. And then um, obviously mine are like whatever. But, they, you know, my shoes, my shoes are just cheap and comfortable, which is fine. Like, Tony... Tony and Mr. Lang both just went in on Blau's shoes. I felt like secondhand awkwardness because they were just, they're both uh, Tony and Mr. Lang have like the same types of shoes. I they're uh, forgot what they were called, but there's like those those high ones, and then like they just went in on on Blau, and I was like, oh god, oh god, and we were sitting in the elevator just looking at each other, and me and Ray were like, uh, <laughs> that was pretty fun though. It was fun. It was a super good trip. I think everyone loved it. Um, yeah. Dress, thanks for the sub, and Avery. But here's the biggest thing, guys. His shoes are really comfortable. I think that's the most important thing, you know? His shoes look like melted... Pl oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, guys, guys, at least roast him on his own stream so he can defend himself. Um, I'm, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. Look, they're comfortable, and that's what's the most important thing. So um, that's what I think. New Phasmo update? I do want to play that. I don't have a squad of friends. I think most of our friends are either tired or busy or both today. Because a lot of them are flying home today, um, or, or like late yesterday, so a lot of them are probably pooped out. Need a rest today, I think. It was a fun, a fun event though. I'm glad everyone came. Jay roasted it too. Jesus, Jesus, man, it's uh, okay. Uh, Dynamite, thanks for the tier three. Barely have any of those. Thanks a bunch, Dynamite and Omni and Honda. Thanks for the subs also. All right. Um. Getting spicy? Well, I'm, I'm not even saying my opinion. I'm just saying what happened. That's all. Um, Honda, thanks for the sub. And uh, Bia, thanks for the sub also. What's the plan for today? Probably just play some random scuffed games. And then um, we're going to play this weird... Hey, you guys remember when we uh, used to bike off Mount Chiliad all the time in GTA? Um, I think we're going to play a game that's pretty much the same thing, except slightly different. I don't know. Um, what events is he talking about? It's, uh, I think it was called EDC. It's like a music thing or something. Wax, thanks for the sub, and Ray. Uh, let's do it again. Well, it's a different game, but I'll see how it goes. Uh, nail polish? Nope. Just regular nails. I feel like I don't want to paint my nails too much, because, uh, I don't know. I feel like it loses the, the hype or something. I have no idea. 
Dino, thanks for the sub. Um, let's see. Is Jay from Day6 streaming? Well, this ain't his stream, so I have no idea. Uh, also, I, I don't know why I would keep track. I, maybe, I, I don't know. Um, anyway. Uh, how am I supposed to respond to that, guys? It's a, yeah. Um, all right. Um, you should get a perm. I mean, I could, but I'm not too picky. Also, the main reason I don't want to get a perm is because you have to sit in a store for like 10 hours, so. Or not 10 hours, but it's a long time, I feel like. Um... All right, they take too long. That's what I thought. I was like, I don't want to sit in a, a thing for like 10 years. It takes forever. Um, my friend got one and her hair fell out. Uh, okay, that's pretty scary. Um, I, I feel like that's rare, hopefully, but I hope your friend's hair grows back. Um, Dino, thanks for the sub. And Soapy and Oracle, thanks for the subs also. Um... What are you doing today? Probably just chilling for a few minutes, and then, uh... You know, we always chill with the chat, and then we, uh... What's it called? And then we play some random scuffed games. That's the plan. You been watching any shows recently? Um... You know, guys, I haven't been watching too many shows lately. I did see a really good... You guys ever see Mob of Psycho? Um... There's this one scene from, I think, the second season, near the end. And I don't want to spoil anything, but it, it reminded me of something that happened recently. And that's probably all I should say about that. Um, oh, Capital, thanks for the sub. Alright. Spoilers? Is that a spoiler? Maybe. Um, let's see, it's a good show. It's good, and it has really good music, too. I think the opening song is amazing. It's, it's pretty cool. Um... Oh, it's got a third season. Okay, it was a really good show, I think. Um, heard of Inscription. I, I think I saw like two people playing it this morning, and I, I had no idea what it is. It was confusing. Um, I, I don't think it's my type of game, if I'm honest. But, let's see. Do you like Death Note? I saw the live action Death Note. It was pretty scuffed. It, it was strange. It was just strange to me. But that's just what I think. Um... Let's see. Cursing, though. Thanks for the sub. Mm. Alright. D colon. Actually, guys, you guys like the... You guys like the live action... Guys, I think my biggest problem with it is in the regular Death Note, uh, Light seems like a big brain genius. And then in the live action, he was just like... I'm not... He was just a thirsty teenager in the live action. You know, I, I hate to be like... It's roasting him too much, but... I was just like, what happened to the big IQ plays? Where's, like, the potato chip and eat it and stuff? Meanwhile, he's just, like, a teenager trying to get a date. And I'm like, what happened to the big brain stuff? Like, I don't know what happened here. So it, it was, the live action was just weird. And, and it didn't catch the vibe of the original at all. Uh, it was just kind of weird, champ, if that's even... And I feel weird saying that, but pretty true. Um, Czar, thanks for the sub, man, Captain. Alright. Um, he was an angsty teen? Yeah, pretty true. I think he, the, the storyline was he was just trying to get a date the whole time. Um, I don't know. Let's see. I can't watch it. It's, it's good for like a good... It's like watching the Squid Game dub. Like, it's good for a different reason because of how not that good it was. Like, it's entertaining for... In a way, sort of. Trying to look at the bright sides. Um... Uh, Marina, thanks for the sub. Alright. Um, live actions usually aren't that great. Probably, yeah. And the other thing, and I don't know if this is a spoiler, why'd they change his name to Light Turner? I just think of Fairly Odd Parents. When, when I, I like, popped it open, and the dude's like, instead of Light Yagami, he's like, my name's Light Turner. And I was like, what is this, Fairly Odd Parents? What just happened? I, <laughs> it was pretty, it was pretty weird, but, um... It was funny a little bit. Um, Golden and uh, Putt, thanks for the sub also. Did you guys see it? Did nobody see it? Or am I the only person shocked by this? Because I, 
I was like really bored and I was like, I'm just going to pull it open on like Netflix or something. And it was just strange. Um, Carrots, thanks for the sub. All right. Go in. Yeah, guys, I feel like this is the most hot take I'll ever give on something. But man, was it weird. You hate it that much? I mean, I did say it was good for a different reason. But guys, did anyone actually like it? Like, I don't know. Um, I, I I feel like this is the most I've ever roasted it. But you can't tell me it doesn't deserve it. I don't know. Um, Sinnoh, thanks for the sub. Oh, and uh, Mighty, thanks for the sub also. That was my reaction too? Yeah, it was pretty... It just threw me off a little bit. Um, all right. It's hot to Garbaggio. Yeah. It was funny, though. It was funny a little bit. Um, I didn't watch the anime, and my brother liked the live action. Oh, God. Um, Huntor, thanks for the sub. Gonna watch the new My Hero movie? Um, I didn't know there was a new one. I actually haven't seen the old one quite yet. But, um, yeah. They changed it so much. They really did. Um, what are you playing today? Uh, just some random stuff. There's an Attack on Titan live action. That could honestly, that could be good if they have, like, unless the Titans look really bad. But, you know, I'm going to be honest. Has there ever been a good anime live action? I don't think I've ever, like, maybe Avatar The Last Airbender live action. No, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. Um, Poo, thanks for the sub. All right. Um... No? Yeah, I have no idea, but... Anyway. Oh, Spleen, thanks for the sub also. I did not like that one. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I've heard of a good one, but maybe. I don't know. Um, let's see. Alice in Borderlands. You know what I think I did wrong, guys? I watched that one because it's also... It's kind of like a survival show without the money, maybe. I watched a few episodes, but the problem was... I watched it right after I watched Squid Game... And I was like, it seems interesting, but I, I don't know. It didn't, it didn't feel as crazy, right? Because I watched Squid Game right at, uh, before, and then, like, I watched a couple episodes of that, and I was like, it doesn't seem bad at all, but, like, it doesn't, I don't know. It's, it, was, it wasn't bad, though. It just didn't, I don't know. It, it's because it was the same type or something. Um, oh, uh, good. Thanks for the three. Mods pick out an outfit for you on the stream. What? Uh, last time I did that, I almost leaked where I live on Amazon. So I'm, I'm kind of manka champing. Um, anyway. Um, let's see. Manka I mean, not not actually. I think I, it shows like the city you live in, which isn't so bad. Also, I already moved from there. I, that was back when I still lived in uh, Los Angeles. So. Um, anyway. Uh, what are we doing today? Probably just chilling with chat and then playing some random scuffed games. That's the idea. Oh, um, Ariana, thanks for the sub. Hmm? Add a wiggle emote. If I had a wiggle emote, I would add it. Um, but I don't have one. So, I don't know what to... I don't know what to say about that, guys. I mean... Um... Oh, uh, Cartino, thanks for the sub. Um, let's see. Thanks for keeping me entertained at work. We haven't done too much yet, but I hope you have a good time at work. Um, let's see. Does Bimbus live in Vegas? No, he lives with my parents. Uh, Mew, thanks for the sub. Has Ludwig asked you to play on his game show? Um, he's asked me before, but I haven't been able to make it. I'm hoping to make it to one in the future. At some point, but we'll see. The the Muggle money um, would be cool to go to. Uh, Mari, thanks for the sub. And uh, Dex. Um, what are we doing today? Probably just chilling with chat and then playing random scuff the games, pretty much. Hmm. You gonna dress up Bimbus for Halloween? Maybe, I don't know. Zevi, thanks for the sub. Zevi? Um, let's see. What do you think about the Squid Game? It's pretty good, yeah. XQC Moggle Money is pretty... Guys, between you and me, I've actually never seen an episode of uh, of Moggle Money. So, 
Um, I, I don't know exactly. I know it's some kind of game show, but that's about it. Does the camera keep flickering? Um, it might. Sometimes it bugs out because the light levels. But, yeah. D colon. It might be better that way, though, because then when I show up on it, I won't know what to expect. You know, it'll be like a fresh experience. Um, Dark, thanks for the sub. All right. Um, you're going to dress up like Bimbus this year. What does that mean? I don't know. Uh, you were featured on it. I think I asked a question about dolphins once. And that was something. Um, let's see. Are girls into Bimbus? Yeah, I'm actually pretty sure girls are more into Bimbus than me. But, you know, he's cute. So I, what can I say? Well, I mean, girls aren't into me at all. So it's not a tough competition. But, you know. Um. Oh, uh, Dark. Thanks for the sub, Dark. Um... Funny joke? Uh, yeah, that was a joke. Definitely not the truth. <sighs> yeah, just a joke. No, it's true, though, guys. Um, anyway. Um, I love dog. Hey, so do I. I'm just saying. Um, quizzical. Thanks for the sub. All right. Um, girls are into... Hey, look, guys. I'm gonna be honest with you. I think I'm non-threatening and, like... Maybe someone, th look, I'm just, I'm going off real life examples, all right? You know, I hang out with my friends all the time, and like, they're, uh, I, I'm just saying, all my friends are attractive dudes, all right? They deserve it for sure, like, they all get, you know, people talk to them, they, I'm just gonna say, they get hit on, all right? My friends, they're good looking guys, like, Blau will be next to, like, uh, you know, he'll be like, near, T will be nearby, girls will still go up to him and, like, talk to him. And I'm always cringed in the corner because, like, look, guys, I, I feel like I'm non-threatening. I'm not, like, I, I don't want to call myself ugly or something. I'm, like, non-threatening, but I'm not, like, attractive. You know what I mean? And there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. My friends, super attractive guys. I like them, and they hang out with me because we're friends. We get along. That's what matters. But, yeah, guys, like, it's it, it's not a thing that happens, genuinely. Um, it's actually true, guys. Like, and there's nothing wrong with it. I'm just saying, actually, that's how it is. Like, they're good-looking guys. They deserve it. But, you know, I'm like a non-threatening dude, you know? Um, but that doesn't mean, you know. Um, Lolly, thanks for the sub. And Kyla. And Coraline. All right. Um, but there's a bright side, guys. There's a bright side, okay? Since I'm, like, not a good-looking dude, at least I know everyone who's my friend just likes hanging out with me and, and likes who I am. Uh, because, obviously, they don't think I look cool. Um... Uh, so there's a bright side to it, maybe. Um, yeah. Anyway, today, thanks for the sub. So basically, um, I think we're we're playing a game uh, later, uh, possibly with mouse, but I'm not 100% sure uh, when we'll be able to uh, do it exactly. Um, oh, today, thanks for the sub. All right, why are you lying? I am not, guys, it's true. Uh, it's actually true. Um, well, that's okay. Alright. Um. Let's see. Have you met a monkey before? Uh, I don't think I've met a monkey. Have I? If I have, I don't remember it. Um. Let's see. Hmm? Um. Back for blood? Not today. I would play it again sometime. I genuinely think the problem with that game is difficulty scaling. Um, all right, give me one sec, guys. I gotta check something real quick. Okay. Oh, uh, Jemmy, thanks for the sub. All right, just give me one sec, guys. Just gotta... Oh, Cyber, thanks for the sub. Streaming during Halloween? I don't know. I don't really plan it out. Um, all right. <clears throat> Sorry guys, I just I was just checking something real quick. Um, have you read Soul? I don't read anything, guys. Phasmobia new update? Yeah, I want to. Um, did you make it to Ryan's house? No, I I told the story earlier. We were one minute late to the restaurant, and they kicked us out. Uh, and it was just yeah, it was. I'm not gonna say the name of the restaurant. 
you know, because I don't want people getting upset at them. But it was just, here's what happened. I, I told the story earlier, but so me and a group of friends, I think like Toast, Yvonne, a bunch of us, we had a reservation at a restaurant um, for six of us, right? Three of us, we were in a taxi, and then uh, there's two, we had to take two taxis because not all six of us could fit. Uh, the first group makes it on time, and then we say, hey, we're here. Can we just sit down? Uh, they're right behind us. They'll be here in like a minute, right? And they're like, no, we can't seat you until all six of you are here. And then the other half of our group shows up one minute, exactly one minute late, and they just kick us out. And that was it. So then we had to leave and find a different place to eat, and it, it, it took us a while, um, and we didn't have enough time to go to Ryan's house anymore, so... It was just weird. I was shocked that they were that strict on it, but what can you do? We were technically late. Um, or I guess technically we weren't late, just like the full group was late, which is like kind of weird to me because I feel like half of us were already there, but I don't know. Did you end up eating somewhere else? Uh, yeah, because we had no choice. We probably would have starved or something. Um. Anyway, yeah. And the weirdest thing is I saw like 10 empty tables there so like it's not like they were packed full or something um but i guess they're just really strict about the time and that's just how it goes um cool blue thanks for the 10 uh for ten dollars and sykes thanks for the sub also name the place there's a reason i'm not going to but what i'll say is you know it was just kind of weird that they did that but i mean i guess you know we didn't have the full group there so yeah um all right. Anyway, um, those seven stars, do they even go up that high? I have no idea, but. Okay. What's the plan for today? Um, we got a couple scuffed variety games in store. Um, and then I, I guess we maybe can go on GTA, but a lot of our friends aren't going to be around because they're probably coming home from the, the weekend and stuff. And they probably, uh, some of them are already home and they're probably tired, so. Um, yep. Let's see. When's the Squid Game in GTA? I was told that it's on Friday at 2 p.m. or something like that. That's what I was told. Um, Ash, thanks for the sub. Um, it's weird. I just think it's weird that they, like, half the group was there and they wouldn't give us one more minute, which was nuts. But, I don't know, I guess it just didn't like us too much, but, um, uh, yeah. Um, alright. Usually when it's happening, there's no waiters. Guys, we had a reservation. Like, how are they not ready for it? I feel like they were ready for it. We were just late and they didn't want to take us in. Unless, like... You're telling me in that one minute they didn't have enough waiters? I, I'm going to give that one a maybe, guys. I think they were just very, very strict on the time. And that's that's it. Um, I don't know. Unless in that one minute the waiter's like, Yeah, I was about to serve you for an hour, but I can't do an hour in one minute. That's too much. Um, so, I, I don't know. Um, anyway, Joseph, thanks for the sub. All right. Um, anyway... That's strange. I thought it was too, but I think we're good, guys. I, I want to make it sound more crazy than it was. I mean, we ended up getting food anyway. Um, Zyros, thanks for the sub. Okay. Uh, I think we should just move on because I feel like people are getting... You know what's weird, guys? People... I, I feel weird when people get offended, like, on my behalf. Because, um, like... Okay, you guys ever see those times when, like... Y your friend like defends you. Okay, this this happened a long time ago, guys. But I was playing League of Legends once. And this was, I mean, you know, this was a long time ago because I don't play League very much anymore. But um, like sometimes, uh, your friend maybe would like defend you against flamers, right? And like it feels kind of good because you're like, oh yeah, my friend's backing me up. But at the same time, it's just weird. I don't want to see my friend of arguing in chat. It just makes me feel worse because then. You see, like, your friend or someone fighting randomly. I don't want to see that. That's weird. I'd rather just ignore it and try and mosey along. Because, like, I don't want to see people fighting each other. Especially if it's, like, you know, someone I know, you know. Like, I, I, I'll say it feels a little good because it's like, oh, yeah, you know they care about you. But at the same time, it makes me feel worse because I don't want to see them, like, getting in that kind of weird situation. 
It's like when, um, you guys, I, I read on the internet this story about, um, what's it called? This crazed girlfriend who just makes her boyfriend get beaten up for her all the time to defend her honor. And I was like, that's kind of weird, I think. Like, shouldn't you not want him to get beaten up all the time? But I don't know. Um, anyway, Hoes and Wan, thanks for the sub. And Kaime and Moira, thanks for the tier two. Um, Monka Champ, I I'm going to be honest, guys. I, I read it on a scuffed, uh, like, a Reddit story someone linked to me. I think it was fake, but it was kind of weird. So, <laughs> anyway, um, Sour, thanks for the sub. Did Toast invite you for Among Us? Uh, no, I, I wasn't invited to that. I didn't even know he was, is that what he's doing? I thought he was, like, on the way home right now. Um, uh, anyway, there's actually people like that. I know them. Oh, God. It's actually real. You guys, you guys seen it before? I, I have no idea, but, um, yeah. Left out? I, I don't think he's, I don't even think it's happening. I feel like it's just one of those bait comments that happen all the time. Um... Okay. What games you playing today? There was this really scuffed word guessing game that I was thinking about playing, but <laughs> I don't know how scuffed it is. And then we have another game, um, I think at 5 p.m. that we can also play, but I don't even know if I want to try that word guessing game. It's ultra scuffed. Um, I guess we could try it for like a few. Actually, you know what we need to do? Um, all right, you guys remember my kelp farm in Minecraft? I've, uh, it's been charging up for days. I'm just saying. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go at least see how much experience I get from it. Cause that kelp farm, farm has been charging up for like three days since I've been gone on the trip. So let's, um, let's open up Minecraft and, uh, see how the kelp farm is doing. Okay. Um, five levels. There's no way. It's got to give me like a bazillion levels. That has to. Um, not. Thanks for the sub. Not. Okay. Let me get the thing set up. Guys, it's going to give us so many levels. It's been charging up for like 10 days, I swear. Not 10 days, like three days or something like that. But still, I think that's a pretty long time. Okay. There we go. Don't leak the IP, don't leak the IP. I think I clicked it fast enough, didn't leak the IP. Okay, thanks for the sub. All right, here it is, guys. The kelp farm. Look at how much kelp is in this box. Look at that. That's a lot of kelp. It's a lot of dried kelp, guys. Just saying. Let's go ahead and craft it into the uh, little dried kelp blocks. Um, okay. There we go. The rest back in. Throw these in there. It's a lot of kelp. That's a lot of kelp. Uh, it's your birthday today. Happy birthday. Um, all right. Let's um. Let's go. There, there's something I needed to do, but I forgot. What's this thing? Okay. Is there anything in here? I don't think so. All right, guys. Let's uh, let's see how much experience we got from our kelp farm. It's been leveling up for days, I think, like multiple days. So this thing's probably maxed out by now, I bet. Let's throw that in. Let it gather. All right, guys. Taking bets. Taking bets on levels here. All right. It's a rainy day. It's making me sad. It's kind of, you know, sort of sad, but I feel like rainy days are kind of chill. Like, they're not all bad. Okay. Five levels, ten levels, twenty levels. Um, all right, guys, let's, let's do this. Twenty-six levels! <laughs> Jesus! That is a lot of levels. Okay. Well, guys, it finally paid off. Twenty-six levels. That's almost enough for a full-on enchant. Um, that's, that's quite an amount of levels. It took several days to, uh, to charge up that much, but it's not a bad amount of levels. Let's, uh, store it up in the XP book to max that out. Took out one level, but that's okay. So this XP book stores about 30 levels, but minus, um, 
the 10% it loses, because apparently you lose XP when you use it. We tested it last time. Uh, it brings you to like level 29. So that's enough for one full enchant. And we almost have enough for another full enchant. Um, we just have to level up a little bit more. But wait, where do I get this kelp from? Uh, maybe the bird wants it. Um, Alright. Uh, Fleer, thanks for the sub. And Blueberry and Ashlyn. Oh, guys, I think I did this off stream, but first of all, I have a secret stash now. So you see this uh, hay field. Looks like nothing's there. But all the way in the back where nobody's ever going to check, secret stash of stuff. What we have here is all our diamonds, iron, gold ingots, amethyst, lapis lazuli, um, the XP book, which is maxed out, an extra staff. Uh, I, why, why do I have oak planks here? Those aren't rare, but we'll put those back in another chest. And then... I got the luckiest enchant on this diamond pickaxe, guys. Look. As Unbreaking 3, Efficiency 4, and Fortune 3. All from one big bonus enchant. Absolutely nuts, I tell you. Like, you know how... So normally you see one enchant, and that's guaranteed. And you have a chance to get other enchants. But we got so lucky that... Um, we got pretty much every bonus enchant you could want. We got, uh, we got Fortune 3. That was the main one. And then we also got Efficiency 4, which makes it mine faster. And then Unbreaking 3. Like, this is almost perfect. All you need is like Mending or something. Because that's about as good as it gets, honestly. Um, we could also make a, a Diamond Sword uh, for enchants. But I don't know if it's worth it, guys. I feel like Iron Swords are already pretty good. You guys think we should make a Diamond Katana? I feel like it's a waste considering how rare Diamonds are. But I don't know. Like, it just feels like it's... Because diamonds are hard to find in this mod pack. Um, Silpha, thanks for the five gifted. Alright. The only reason I think this is worth it is because the durability is much, much higher. So, if you enchant it, it'll last much longer. Axe is way better. Uh, di it's definitely not better. There's no chance. Alright, so what we're going to do is make a backup pickaxe. Because we might lose this one and also... Um, What's it called? We might lose that one, and also uh, we could give it away to someone who needs the pickaxe. Make a diamond sword. I think the katana is better than the regular sword for sure. Because the special ability is absolutely nuts on it. Here, look. You can do this dashing attack. It teleports you and slashes anything you pass through. So not only does it look cool, it's actually kind of insane. Because you can hit things and they don't have a chance to hit you back. So it's kind of crazy. A oh, uh, month. Thanks for the sub. Katana's better? Yeah, I agree. It's a lot better. Um, let's go check on the en Dark Enchanter. Wait, what the? Huh? What? Uh, what? The? Wh what? Well, how's this work? What? How's this work? Um... What is this, guys? Vein mining. Um, I'm mildly confused as to what's happening here, but... Huh? Can you just choose what enchant... There's no way. You can just choose what enchants you get. Um, the only problem is it does seem to cost... You can choose, but the problem... Um, is it costs so much. So I have 933 experience at level 25. Let's pop this thing on. What do I want? Sharpness. Um, looting's pretty good. Sweeping edge, you don't need it too badly. Um, sharpness is good. Looting's good. Now you could get unbreaking, but that's going to cost a lot. Maybe we go mending. This costs like 3,000... Guys, I feel like it's, it's kind of cool. Wait, what the? Thunder Slash? What is this? Dragon Slash? Comb Cutter. I've never heard of these in my life. It costs so much XP, though. I, I don't know if it's worth it. Silpha, thanks for the five gifted. I mean, it seems good because you can just choose everything you want. But at the same time, I, I can't help but feel like... Man, this is expensive. Um... If I wanted to, like, kind of get a little cheaped out, I could go Sharpness. 
Knockback, you don't need. Fire, you don't need that. Looting is pretty good. I would want looting. Sweeping Edge just increased the AoE. I don't really need that because I usually just kill my friends on accident. Unbreaking, it's good because it'll save you some XP. But you don't need it if you have Mending. Uh, especially on the sword. Uh, on a pickaxe, it might be more important, I think. Because Mending, when you're using your sword, you're almost always going to get the XP back. So I think these three we could get away with. And then I'd probably want one of these just because it sounds cool, but I don't know what it does. And it's cheap. It's only like 100 XP. But just for the three basic enchants, it'd be 4,300. We only have 933 at level 25. That's pretty pricey. Um, I don't know if that's worth it. Is there a regular table? Guys, I'm not going to lie. This just doesn't seem worth it. Because it's so expensive on the XP. I'd rather just hit level 30 and hope I get lucky. Yeah, you'd have to be super, super high level. I, it just doesn't seem... You don't have to put it all the way to the right. You don't have to, but it doesn't make much sense. Yeah, I think an XP farm would make this table good, but you need so much. I mean, even the kelp farm won't generate this much. Um, is discounted 40%? Yeah, that would be nuts. You can use your XP book. It won't get me to 4,000, that's for sure. Um, I think I might just want to find... A regular one. Make two more kelp farms? That still won't be enough. Guys, I let my kelp farm charge up for three days, and it got me about 900 to 1,000 XP. Which means, to get that sword with three kelp... Uh, it would take se it would take like a week, guys. Um, it's just not... And then if I want to get another item, I can get an enchanted pickaxe and an enchanted sword in a week. That is not some. It's not even close to good. I'm pretty sure I could do it better in any other way. Um, oh, Britt and Miranda. Thanks for the subs. Better XP farms? I could make an Enderman farm if we went to the end, but nobody's been there yet. So This is pretty much all we got so far. And it's not too bad, in all honesty. It's not too bad. Um, all right. There's a kelp farm that can give you 30 XP in seconds. Uh, if it's one of those weird laggy zero tick ones, I don't think we're going to use that. We need like a legit looking one. Uh, yeah. Man, that sucks. Does anyone else have an enchanting table on this server? Somebody else has to have a regular enchanting table. Would it be bad if I just go lurk about in random people's houses until I find some... Someone else has one. We just have to, you know... Let's just go lurk around in people's houses. This person's house looks fancy. Um, what kind of ladder is this? I've never seen that before. Well, I don't think there's an enchanting thing in here. It does look really nice, though. But, um... Let's see. Who plays on this server? Um, I think Iron Mouse and... Oh! Wait, that didn't make it through. You can teleport through the fence. All right, so that's that's why the katana I think is better, because you can do like weird busted plays. Oh, those are tier twos. Thanks a bunch, Silfarian, for the tier twos. Barely have any of those. You jumped out of the fence. Yeah, it's because of the sword special move. I think we just put these away. I really wanted to enchant them, but there's no way we can get like the four thousand experience we need. So, yeah. Um, all right, let's go ahead and, uh, put these away. We'll get to enchanting them. I mean, it's not a waste of diamonds because these are going to be good eventually somehow or another. I think it's really good. It just costs so much experience that it's, it's tough. Um, all right, here we go. Get a monster spawner and make a farm. Guys, how am I just going to get a monster? How am I just going to find a monster spawner? It doesn't... It doesn't. If we find one, conveniently, that's near the spawn, maybe we could do it, but it's not like we just go find one, guys. I, I'm not saying it's terrible advice. It's just not realistic advice is what I'm saying. Ace, thanks for the sub. All right. Um, make a darker room? I mean, I, guys, guys, look, look. I got the kelp farm. Um, we're working it out. It's not too bad. I, I think it's working for the most part. Okay-ish. Um, at least the kelp farm gave us a bunch of levels, so that's good. 
Um, all right. Let's see. So I, I do want to get some more diamonds because we have our fortune pickaxe, but um, I don't think we can stall for too long. I, I just want to... Wait, who built the... Wow, my neighbors have upgraded. Wait, guys, remember when our neighbors had nothing? We gave them bread and stuff? Our house is still scuffed looking. They built like an actual house. Maybe they have an enchanting table. Guy May, thanks for the sub. The world looks pretty. You know what I was saying, guys? I actually like the server a lot because not everybody's just rushing diamonds and protection for. Not that anything's wrong with playing like that. But guys, it's the server's been alive for like like two weeks or something now. Most people don't even have like iron armor. They're just like building houses and like playing with each other and stuff. It it reminds me a lot of the uh, the original Minecraft server I used to play with with our friends. Like when Yvonne fought me for a piece of string. And then we had to f have a fire bending arena battle and stuff. Like back when we were just doing silly stuff all the time instead of, uh, you know, like trying to farm the best armor second day on the server. Fortune 3 protection for mending villager trapped in a cave that you can trade emeralds and paper for. You know, before we did all that stuff, we just derped around like trolling each other and the, the Agni Kai and stuff. Like that was cool stuff. It reminds me of that. The villager? Yeah, we had that villager that we, we spam sold in paper to get emeralds, and then we sold them back the emeralds from Mending Book. I mean, it worked, and it was very smart, but, you know, it's uh, it a different vibe. I kind of missed that a little bit. Voy, thanks for the sub. Toast blowing up the world? Yeah, those are some good days, guys. Those are some fun days. Um, but there's this thing now, and you can crawl. You can also just push C. Um, all right. Old man toast after retirement. And those are some good days, guys. Good days. But anyway, I was just checking really quick to show you guys the kelp farm. Made a lot of progress. Um, I think we almost, well, we just need to find a regular enchanting table. Um, because the dark one, I, I, I'm going to be honest. I think it just costs too much experience. Like, for the price, it's, it's just 4,000 experience. And level 30 is, uh... I think it's 1500 or something, right? Or maybe even a little... I don't, I don't know exactly how much. But it's just crazy that you can basically get three full-powered enchants for the price of one. Which is like... One, like, fully enchanted enchant. I feel like you might be able to get it all done with for cheaper than that. Vey has an OP enchanting table. I mean, it's really good. It just costs so much experience. I don't know if it's worth it. So... I'm going to give that one, like, a heavy, heavy maybe. Um, yeah. All right. But anyway. Um, oh, uh, Bale. Thanks for the sub, Bale. Normal enchants cost three. Yeah, I think that's the other thing, right? So you get to level 30, you do an enchant, and you only lose three levels. You don't even pay the full experience. So I feel like it's just not worth it, because it doesn't even cost you all 1,500 experience. Probably cost you a few hundred. So for the price of that one fully enchanted sword, you can get like, uh, you know, a lot of enchants out of it, which it just seems like a bad, inefficient usage of it. Um, yeah. You can't get mending, so why not just add mending later then? Right? That sounds like a plan. All right, but here is uh, plan B. Time to play the scuffed, scuffed game I found for 10 minutes. Um, it's like a weird puzzle game, and I'm pretty sure somebody in chat's probably already played it, but we're going to be playing this for about 10 minutes, and we'll see how it goes. I, I don't know. Um, all right. Um, uh, okay. What is this? Have you guys seen this game before? I, I haven't seen too many people playing it, but... I thought it was funny. Um, I recognize the music. I hope not, because if I get DMCA, I'm gonna be sad. Wait, what's play with Twitch me? Seems like a bad idea. I'll let you guys chat. So basically, the way it works is it shows you a picture, and we have to guess the hidden words. Now, it's not what you think. The hidden words aren't like words that are in the picture that it doesn't show you. Uh, it's just words that are based on the picture. 
and you have to guess. And then the words in the top, uh, these letters give you something. So we can just guess like, so people are thinking France, it's not France. Um, let's see. You guys got protest? Oh, oh, you got it. Okay, that's one. So these are all the words. And this is a hint of uh, some of the letters are bait. Some of them are legit. And you just have to try and get it. Flag, maybe? Oh, flag? Okay. Wait, guys, I'm just reading chat. I should play a little bit. Um, light? Okay. Sign? Oh, okay. It's obviously not sign. There's no four letters. Crowd? Oh, my God. You guys are good at this. Okay. Guys, am I cheating? I should play a little bit on my own. Oh, my God. Okay. I, that one I figured out. Umbrella. No. Okay. Six letters. Um... I don't know. I don't know. Six letters. This has got to be the last word. People. <gasps> we did it. Okay, this is legit just a bird. If it's not bird, how is it not bird? It's four letters. This isn't bird. Okay. I mean, guys, what else is in the picture? Like, this is a pretty plain looking picture to me. Uh, beak. No. Rope. Uh, tree. Rainforest? What, what is this? Forest? Tree? Wait, wait. Feather. Okay, I got feather. Um, guys, actually, I, I need help. The only one I could think of is feather. I, I don't know. Branch? That is not a branch. That's a rope, I think. Wait, what? It's branch? <laughs> okay. Um, maybe it's a parrot? Okay. Um... What else? Hey, Yali? This hint's got to tell me something. I just don't know what. Okay, four letters. Wire. Cables. Um, yellow. Yellow? Okay, you guys, are you guys cheating or what? Uh, have you guys seen this game before? Is that why? Um, beak. Thanks for the sub. Beak. I don't think it's beak. So there's only one word left. So that's the hint for it. So you have to be able to spell the word with these letters. Some of them are bait letters. You just don't know. Head? It does spell head. Man, guys, I should play. Okay, okay. No, no looking at chat. I'm going to beat this one on my own. How much time? We got five. We're going to beat this one. Fruit. Bowl. Um, yo, what word is this thing? This is such a long peanuts. Okay, jar. Um, storage. Box, container, fruit salad. Uh, okay, there's a fish right there. Fish. Um, peanut. Is that a peanut? It's so blurry, I can't tell. Beans. Oh, it's garbanzo beans. Garbanzo. Okay, I'm just gonna look at the hint. What do we have? B B R. Oh, bl wait. Can you? Let's try it. Blackberry. Oh my god, that was a big word. Raspberry. Of course, of course. And I think grape. One word left. I'm actually figuring it out. Okay. I'm going to figure this one out. I, I did it without chat. This whole one, just one word left that I can't think of. Let's see. Um, Biba. Uh, what? How much time? I, I got like four minutes. I, I got to think of something. What else is left? What else is... Okay, raspberry? Blackberry? Raspberry? Oh, it's probably just blueberry, isn't it? <laughs> Wait, so everything else was a bait? Um, right, we're on level 5 now, so it gets harder as the levels go up. We're on level 5 now. Uh, some antlers. It's for sure deer. Horn? Uh, what is this? Um, I have no idea what this is. I, uh, field. Eye. Ear. Ear. Nose. Five letters. Five horse. <laughs> um, I don't know. Five letters with these letters. Duh. Uh, I don't know. Antler? No, no, that's there's no chance that's antler. 
Guys, I don't know what word you can even spell with this. Um, five letters. You guys think it's brown? It's brown. How is it brown? There's no way I would have guessed that if... <laughs> I gotta stop. Maybe I, I'll do this without chat, you think? Grass? Oh yeah, grass looks right with those words. Guys, do I do it without chat and just look like I have a sub-zero IQ? I got two minutes. Let's see how far we can get. I'm closing chat. Let's see how far we get. Um, sushi. Restaurant. Um, avocado. No. Roll. Uh, what else? What else? Fish. What? Rice. Okay. Okay. Uh, yo, what? What is this word? There's like two vowels in here. This looks like phasmophobia or something. Op, op, um, op. Let's see. Okay, I'm thinking chopsticks. Oops, chopsticks. <gasps> One word left. These are the letters. What could this be? Six letters. Six letters. Salmon. Oh wait, no, that's not even in the. Okay, look at the letters. We gotta look at the letters. How much time? We got like a minute. I can do it. I can do it. Just one left. Um, it's not avocado. Mayo? No, no. Um, mm, I don't know. What could it be? Why isn't... Napkin. Napkin. Okay, it's not a napkin. Uh, there's no A. I don't know what this could even spell. Okay, I'm just gonna type everything. Rice, plate, um, roll, mayo, sauce, uh, hair, necklace, uh, hand, nail. Did I already type nail? <laughs> table, table? There's no way it's table. What, what is this thing? Sauce? That's six, six letters, six letters, six letters, um... Chops? I already did that. I have no idea. All right, what is it? Ginger? Finger? That's weird. I wouldn't have guessed that. There was a finger there. Man, this game is weird, but it's kind of fun in a little bit. Um, all right. <clears throat> Look the chat, guys. We got so close. We got like five of them. All right. We got like five of them, guys. I'm just saying that's not too bad. Um, okay. So here's the plan now. What happened? We guessed five of them. It's just the last one we didn't get. It's a finger food? I guess so. And there's a legit finger there. That was pretty fun. I would play it again sometime. But right now, guys. Um, all right. Um, let's see. Okay. Here we go, guys. We're doing a... Uh, what's the plan now? Doing a sponsored stream uh, for Riders Republic. It's, um, hold on. I got to post an Instagram story. Um, it's sold. Hey guys, I didn't even say anything yet. So you can click the link under, uh, look well guys, you don't have to be sold on it. It's actually uh, free to play right now. Uh, we're sponsored by Ubisoft uh, for playing this, this. It's basically a mountain biking game. You just ride a bike off a mountain, try not to die. Um, and you don't even have to be sold on it. If it's free to play right now for the next uh, few days, I think it ends October 27th is what they told me. You can click the link below uh, below the stream to uh, to try it out. And even if you don't want to try it out, you can click it out, click it anyway. Just look at it or something. But uh, basically, you just go mountain biking off a mountain and try not to die. Um, so let's go ahead and open it up. And hopefully it's fun. I actually played a little bit already. Um, Okay, so the only thing is it is one of those games where when you first open the game, it's super duper loud. So I'm going to deafen everything for a second as I open the game because uh, it is super loud when you first open it. So, yep. Lexi, thanks for the sub also. Sold because it's free. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So if you guys want to look at it or if you want to try it, you can click the link below the stream. Um, there's also a chat bot that shows up every once in a while, but between you and me, Probably ain't gonna see that too much because the chat moves quite quickly. So uh, anyway, let's let's open it up and um, yeah. 
All right. I'm opening it. I'm deafened right now, guys. You got to give me a second because it is very loud when it opens. So I just don't want to don't want to blow out your eardrums or anything. Um, Chibi, thanks for the sub. Okay. Yep, super loud, just like I remember. The moon, thanks for the sub. Yeah, just give me one second, guys. I, I have to set it up. It's still really loud, um, but it'll be done in a second, I think. All right, we're good. Let me just uh, change the game capture. All right, there we go. Maybe I turn the volume up a little bit more. What's well, at 50? I'm not going to lie, guys. I think this game was designed for controller, but... Um, is this too loud? It's probably fine. We're going to 70. Um, all right. That SFX, we'll turn it up to like 70. We can turn it lower later if we want. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty sure this was designed for controller, but I'm going to be playing on like mouse and keyboard. Um, it is free until October 27th uh, to try. And then you can click the link below to see it. Name of the game, it's Riders Republic. There's no sound. Um, it should it should be working, I think. Uh, it says it's working on my end. I don't know if uh, something else is wrong. Luca, thanks for the 10 gifted. I hear it. All right, perfect. There is an important setting that we need to make sure is on. Um... Right here, copyright music, it's off. So that's very important. Um, gotta make sure that's off. Uh, but yeah, that's it. So here's the problem, guys. Um, I was originally gonna be playing with mouse for this, um, but you can't play multiplayer until you finish the tutorial. It's it's really low. I can turn it. I can turn it louder. Um, I can turn it louder if you guys want. I, I thought it was decent-ish volume, but um, I don't know. All right. So here's the real problem. I was doing the tutorial for like 30 minutes last night, and um, Holy what's it called? Shiz -whistle. Congratulations! You've qualified um, for But I, I, I'm only three out of this seven through, and I didn't want to play stuff, it for like five we'll hours. So out, okay? um, remember, we're gonna have to finish the cute, tutorial, then we can cute. play together. But keep is going, because there's a ton of stars to bank here. Whack, thanks for the sub. All right. Holy whistle. Oh, God. All right, so we're on, a, you can see on the left side, we're at three out of seven on the tutorial. So, or on the introduction, which I assume is the tutorial. So we got to finish that. But basically, we just ride a bike off a mountain and try not to die. Um, you don't really use your mouse. You can do jumps. Uh, I'm, uh, honestly, I'm pretty pretty good at it already because like, I don't even need the tutorial. And then you just you just do that, and then I think that was bad. But all right, let's go. Uh, let's go to the place. I think we just teleport there, right? I'm not gonna lie, I forgot how to open my. Wait, you can do first person. You think this is better, guys, or worse? I think it's worse. Does anyone know how to open the map on this game? Maybe I do need the tutorial. <laughs> um. Can you fall in the game? Uh, I mean, yeah, I think so. Like, if you just... Oh, God. <laughs> Wait, do you die? No way I have to ride all the way back. Um, I, I don't know what... Oh, wait, we just respawn here. I don't know how to open the map, but we'll, we'll figure it out. See how Versus is locked out? It's because we haven't finished the tutorial, so... Now, I don't know what any of these means. I'm assuming bigger number means better. If I learned anything from uh, ye old Ludwig, a bigger number is better, or something like that. Um, M to open map. I think I tried that. It didn't work. Take off with questions. Here we oh, go. I skipped. Red Bull Wait, are these real players? Wait a minute. These are real players. These look like real players. All right, we we can win. We can win. Absolutely. It's gonna be a fantastic. Right, go real fast. Jump up. Do a jump. That was a bad landing. That looked perfect to me. All right. Let's just go on this way. You guys, sure, it's not too loud. It's like a little bit on the loud side for me. But it's not like terribly loud. It's just a little too loud. But right. Jonathan, thanks for the sound. Oh, God. Man, I, I feel like we need a little bit of music for this, but I don't want to get DMCA'd, so. <gasps> oh, we're fine. Please. Oh, God. 
Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Just we'll place them in. We'll we'll place them in eighth eighth. Oh God. Oh, now, we're warming up. It's a tutorial, guys. It's a tutorial. Um, I bet. Wait, is this dude just walking? That dude's just walking. Um. Yeah. This my dude's insane. Oh. Maybe we shouldn't do such crazy tricks. Maybe we just we just try and finish, guys. Let's just try and finish. It is the tutorial. Actually, we're in sixth place. We're not doing too. Nah. Egg. Oh, why? Why did you spin like that, guys? I, I'm playing on control. I'm playing on mouse and keyboard, and I'm pretty sure this is a controller-based game. So oh, that was a pretty decent landing. It's pretty decent landing, I'd say. I wish I could see the map because I don't know if we're supposed to turn or if we're supposed to. Right, over here, we're, pla we're passing this guy. We're passing this guy, guys. This is bad. This is actually perfect land. No chance that was perfect. This game's bugged. I mean, uh, uh, I'm sponsored. Uh, this is, yeah, the game knows exactly what I'm doing because that was definitely a clean landing. Um, <clears throat> yeah, thanks again for the sponsor. Uh, um. <clears throat> Oh my god! Okay, that actually was a good landing. That was actually pretty good. Oh! Thank god for the helmet, guys. That helmet, it's made of... What on earth is happening? Please. Oh god. Um, wait, we're in third place? Yeah, guys, look. I'm pretty bad at this game. I'm, I'm not gonna say anything, but... Yo, that dude's stuck on a rock. <laughs> that dude's just stuck on a rock. <laughs> Wait, guys, we're in first place. We're actually winning. Uh, I, 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 we're winning, guys. First place. Let's go. Oh God. Okay. okay. Uh, how do we know how far behind they are? Can we even look behind us? Oh, there's the end. Oh, we made it. We win. We did it. First place. <laughs> that should not have been a first place, guys. I, um. All right, well, there you have it. First place, just like that. The speeding bullet, that's me. I think these are real players. Hey. These, are, these are real players that we actually beat, I think. Hey. Um, okay. Hey. <clears throat> Not bad. I, I think we should be on four out of seven. Hopefully, we can play together later, but... Um, playing this with CB, it would be kind of funny, because, like... Wow. <laughs> you just, like, wipe out and stuff. Filthy. Filthy riding at the Red Bull Holy Bike. All right. Remember, slaying big events. Red like that Bull, what? Hey guys, I don't drink that. I only drink a Jafuel. Um, right. I, I don't support any of the cool new I, I, a Jafuel. Um, Quartz like Uno. First, we've got how do I skip this? I gotta skip this before I get in trouble. Um, I'm, just, I'm just kidding. Well, you're gonna love it. Um, how do we actually close the map? Okay. Celeste, thanks for the sub. Riders a Ridge. Go to the Tricks Academy. All right, let's go. Um, Tibia, thanks for the sub. Oh, here we go. Tricks Academy. Oh, this dude's on a snowboard. I thought it was a mountain biking game. What up, rider? So, you want to yeah. learn how to pull off some gnarly tricks in the Republic? Is it, is it frozen? It's a matter of mastering three important steps. Is it frozen? Uh, oh, Number okay. One, the preparation. Uh, maybe it was, that was supposed this to happen. This is key to a perfectly executed trick. Geese, thanks for the sub. Two. The trick itself. Front yeah, guys, I don't need instructions. Grabs, I know how to play. Grabs. Look, the trick itself, I, you just push the buttons that show up on the screen. Like, I know they have, like, tutorials and stuff, but I'm just going to play, and if I mess up, the button will pop up on the screen and just tell me how to play. So, I mean... Okay, um... Here we go. <laughs> easy, easy. There. <laughs> Oh god! Oh wait, we're fine. Oh, am I dead? I'm I'm not dead. Wait, I'm like doing these. Oh god. Okay. This is, this is too easy, guys. It's too easy. Alright, over here. And then and then let's do a uh, Oh I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm not dead. Okay. Oh god! I'm backwards! What's happening? Alright, look guys, this this tutorial's too long. I've already gotten it. Um 
Oh god. Honestly, that was not bad. Am I actually going guys look at the speed? I'm actually going like 90 kilometers. Wait, how fast is that in miles per hour? I'm from uh How fast is that? Is that really fast? People actually go a hundred kilometers. What's just that? Did I just bug the game? I, I have no idea. 60 miles an hour on a on a on a what is this snowboard? Wait, what, what do you mean checkpoint missed? What does that mean? Huh? I, I don't know what just happened there, but I think we beat it. Guys, you can go 60 kilometers per hour on a, on a snowboard. <laughs> um, is that normal? Is it sponsored? Yep, uh, it's sponsored. We have a hashtag ad and stuff. Um, all right. Um, all right. Let's see over here. What am I doing? What, is this the same thing? What changed? Oh, it's trying to tell me how to spin, maybe. I can't believe that didn't get me killed, but... Oh, God. Eh. Oh, God. How's that a bad landing? That was a, a, such a good landing. Did I, did I just do this? I'm pretty... Wait, land a perfect spin with manually landing. Okay. That wasn't a perfect spin, actually. This has got to be... I spinned like 10 times. Okay, it was a bad landing. It was a bad landing, but for sure this time we'll get it. Okay, bad landing. That's fine, that's fine. Okay, medium landing. Oh, this one's... Uh, the tutorial's got me stuck, guys. Somebody, somebody. Um, hold it to spin. I don't get it. I couldn't do a single spin. Oh! <laughs> oh, no. Um. Alright. Can you play as a female character? Are they better? I, I don't know how to remake it. I think... We have to redo it. Are you okay? Yeah, my dude's fine. Uh, think. Um.